I don't get much time off from the tavern, but I enjoy it when I do. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the Bannered Mare from Hulda. Before my Ma and Da passed, I told them that one day, I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. You do that? If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? Farewell.
acceptance for my supper is all the finest cuts, fresh from the wilds. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. Thank you. This should turn that old cat's gaze. Maybe I'll be able to become a caravaneer myself one day. As promised, let me show you a thing or two about bargaining. Don't want some shifty merchant giving you a raw trade. It was a pleasure. Thank you. Chops and steaks fit for you I've got a hungry dog. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. More inside. Aye, that I do. I've got to, if I hope to be as good as Yorland Greymane someday. In fact, I just finished my best piece of work. It's a sword. I made it for the Jarl, Balgroof the Greater. It's a surprise. I don't even know if he'll accept it, but... Listen, could you take the sword to my father, Preventus Avenici? He's the Jarl's steward. He'll know the right time to present it to him. Thanks. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. Nope. Sorry. Now should be taken to find the stall. Balbro. Did you slip out again last night for a drink at the Planet Mayor? Heard about that, did you? Yes, I went out for a pint or two. What of it? These secret visits to the tavern will make you an easy target for an enemy assassin. You should have told me first. Damn it, woman, I'm the Jarl of Whiterun. I won't apologize for talking to my people. You can't protect me every moment of the day. That might be so, but it will never stop me from trying. I serve Jarl Balgruff as steward. From Adrian? Ah, this must be that weapon for the Jarl. Poor girl. So eager to prove herself. I'll present it to Balgruff when his mood is agreeable. Thank you. Please, take these few coins for services rendered. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. I'm not a man. I'm a weapon in human form. Just unsheath me and point me at the edge. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. Did you hear me? Yep, the ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your. Did I see you talking to Sven? Make sure we get Maybe not. Messages. Maybe. Never mind. But I would stay away from him if I were you. He's a bard, so he says. Occasionally, he finds time to do his job here at the mill. Thinks his ballads and sonnets are going to convince Camilla Valerius to marry him. As if she would say yes. An intelligent, beautiful woman like her wouldn't fall for that nonsense. I hope. I don't need your jokes right now. But maybe you have a point. Maybe Camilla needs some help seeing Sven for what he is. Could you... Could you give her this letter and say it's from Sven? I think I've matched that Nord's lack of cleverness perfectly. The corn stores are getting low again. All right then. Wait, let me guess. You'll get to it later. Don't I always? Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. <laughs> Sorry you had to hear that. Maybe you could talk some sense into my pig-headed brother. 
Another poem, I bet. He does know how to make a girl blush. What's this? If that oaf thinks all I'm going to do is stay in that filthy house of his and clean, I'll... You can tell Sven that he already has a mother. I'm not speaking to him anymore. Until next time. Tell me as soon as you've given Camilla the letter. I appreciate your help. Please, take this. Some gold I've saved up from working at the mill. Looks like you've already got someone with you. 